How many to say? First one. Breathe. There'll be no cameras there. A gift from the Prince of Jubba. You remember India? Like it was yesterday. It's been what? 20 years? Longer. You're still the same. Still shining. Not as much as you, dear. Mm. Seating plan. Friday's charity. Lady Spencer cannot sit next to the Judges of Cornwall, mm -hmm. one sleeping with another's husband. And the Lord of Sussex should be closer to us. His son is in the Ministry of Defence and can help with your appointment as the first Sea Lord. Mm. Mm. And I see most of my friends have not made the list. Alcoholic Marxism writers of homosexual erotica may just be a bit too radical for the rest of them. My friends are far better company than those stuffy raw snobs. You know damn well I come from a long line of stuffy raw snobs. <laughs> of course, and they never fail to remind me that I'm a commoner. They're just insecure, because you're richer than all of them. And yet you so desperately seek their approval all the time. To make up for you scandalising them all the time. Oh, but my darling, it's just so much fun to shake things up, just a little bit. I suppose that's why we work, you and I. I like to fit in, and you will stop at nothing to stick out. And together we'll run circles around them all. Us against the world, Dickie. Us against the world. Always. He looks handsome. Mm. Have fun, darling. How many today? First one. Breathe. There'll be no cameras there. A gift from the Prince of Juba. You remember India? Like it was yesterday. Been what? Twenty years? Longer. You still look the same. You're still shining. Not as much as you, dear. <laughs> Seating plan. Friday's charity. Lady Spencer cannot sit next to the Duchess of Cornwall. One is sleeping with another's husband. And the Lord of Sussex should be closer to us. His son is in the Ministry of Defence and can help with your appointment as the first Sea Lord. Mm -hmm. And I see most of my friends have not made the list. Alcoholic Marxists and writers of homosexual erotica may just be too radical for the rest. My friends make far better company than those stuffy royal snobs. You damn well know that I come from a long line of stuffy royal snobs. And of course, they never fail to remind me that I'm a commoner. They're just insecure, because you're richer than all of them. And yet you so desperately seek their approval all the time. To make up you scandalising them all of the time. Oh, my darling, it's just so much fun to shake things up. Just a little bit. I suppose that's why you and I work. I like to fit in, and you will stop at nothing to stick out. And together we'll run circles around them. Us against the world, Dickie. Us against the world. Always. She looks handsome. Mm. Have fun, darling. As should you. What took you so long? My migraine's been acting up all day. The entire European press is waiting. I'm the chief guest. And you're late. I'm getting addicted. 
Why are you being so hostile? Read this. A leading hostesses association with the coloured man has become the talk of the town. One day the couple was caught in compromising circumstances. This is ludicrous. They'd make up anything to sell a few copies. Buckingham Palace wants me to sue the paper. They've been crawling non-stop. We don't have to dignify this vulgar gossip with a response. I'm going to have to sue the paper, Edwina. You'll be my co-compliant. This is non-negotiable. God, it amazes me how much it matters to you what Buckingham Palace thinks. Why don't you understand? This could hurt my chance of becoming the first sea lord. It's always about your image, your career. I'm not to see that chap again. Why? Because he's a man of colour. I don't care. They do. There's nothing going on between us. And even if there was, we both agreed not to question one another's private lives. All right, later. The camera's everywhere. You'll have to put on a show. What took you so long? My migraine's been acting up all day. The entire European press is waiting. I'm the chief guest, and you're late. You're getting addicted. Why are you being so hostile? Read this. A leading hostesses association with a colour man has become the talk of the town. And one day the couple was caught in compromising circumstances. This is ludicrous. They'd make up anything to sell a few copies. Buckingham Palace is wanting me to sue the paper. I've been calling non-stop. We don't have to dignify this vulgar gossip with a response. I'm going to have to sue them, Edwina. You'll be my co-compliant. This is not a good job. God, it amazes me how much it matters to you what Buckingham Palace thinks. Why don't you understand? Hmm? This could hurt my chances of becoming the first sea lord. It's always about you, isn't it? Your career, your image. You're not to see that chap again. Why? Because he's a man of colour? I don't care. But they do. There's nothing going on between us. And even if there was, we agreed not to question one another's private lives. All right, Clayton. Camera's everywhere. You have to put on the shirt.